everyone once again welcome to Sakti Dharvan Data Tutorial in this video we'll see how to draw the area structure like slab or row so to do that we'll go to XY view so now we are on the XY view as you can see from the right side so our top floor is activate now we'll go to button so now we are at the first floor row so here we have three options poly area drawing option we have rectangle area drawing option and we have quick draw area when our structure is not rectangular or not square then we will use this draw poly area option by clicking here we can go to properties of object window from here we will select the section as it is in default section because i didn't define any slab or floor so i will use this one now so from here we are going to draw the poly area as you can see it has been added and we will click on enter the right side we can also see prismatic view we will select the window after that we will go to display options from here we will go to fill object and i will click on apply area structure has been added in this corner after that we can also use the other options so we have draw rectangular area we can use this one after that we'll click just like this we'll click here we'll go like this so we can continue and we have another option which is which is quick draw area if you select this one just we will just click in a closed area and the structure will be drawn so it is really super easy So we have shown the three options. First one is poly, the second one was rectangular, and the third one was quick draw area. So in this way, we can draw the area structure. So now we'll go to the upper floor, second floor. We'll select any one of this, and then we'll click on the structure. And lastly we have the final floor we'll go to the top floor and then we'll just draw the area structure so as you can see it is super easy we can also go to draw toolbar and from here we have the same option so we have used the shortcuts from here to the left side as you can see we have drawn all the area structure for this building we can rotate the building so in this way we can define or we can draw the area structure to the building i hope this video helped you a lot i'll see you in the next video